how often does this happen to you? You're in the shower, shower curtain closed, water from the shower head, and then the shower curtain creeps in and touches your leg. <laughs> Ew. I'm Anthony, and I will explain to you why the shower curtain seems to attack you and how the same principle has changed the way we travel. So, let's start with a simple experiment. If I blow air between these two papers, will they move apart? Will they move closer together? Or will they remain where they are? OK, let's have a show of hands. Who thinks that when I blow air between the two papers, they will move apart? All right. Who thinks that they will move closer together? And who thinks that they will remain where they are? All right, let's see who's right. So I will blow some air between the two papers, and they moved closer together. Again, this is known as the Bernoulli principle. So what happened? When I blow air between the two papers, air on the inside has high velocity. Air on the outside has low velocity. The Bernoulli principle states that the velocity and the pressure are in some sense opposite. So in this case, we have low pressure on the inside and high pressure on the outside, which will squeeze the two papers together. Now, let's scale it up a bit. When we go to the train station, on the platform, there is a yellow line, which we should stay behind. But why? Because if I step on the yellow line and the train passes by, the train drags some air. So the air in front of me has high velocity. The air behind me has low velocity. By the Bernoulli principle, we get low pressure in front of me and high pressure behind me, which will push me towards the moving train. But what is the main application of the Bernoulli principle? Aeroplanes. Because given the shape of a wing of an aeroplane, air moves faster on top of the wing and slower below the wing. So by the Bernoulli principle, we get low pressure on top of the wing and high pressure below the wing, which will push the wing up, creating lift. Now, let's go back to my shower. Shower curtain closed, water from the shower head. This water is moving the air inside the shower. So we have high velocity on the inside and low velocity on the outside. By the Bernoulli principle, we get low pressure on the inside and high pressure on the outside, which will push the cold shower curtain towards my leg. But when the Bernoulli principle makes the shower curtain creep up your leg, cut it some slack, for it is the same principle that has revolutionalized the way we travel. Thank you.